woke up having this mixed berry smoothie for breakfast so we're filming another episode for dive today we're also gonna have a photo shoot since it's a new season with our new guest so i have to go to the shop to get my hair and makeup done and i figured that i would cut my hair today i'm gonna go back to a short bob because my hair right now gosh focus 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 hello Oh my gosh Okay I want to cut it one last time before I start growing it out again Professional. <laughs> Took me a year to do it. She does it in five seconds. <laughs> If you want to put do one where you like oh, perfectly yeah, leaving that. space, that in the middle. Middle. guys i am about to go hit the gym i'm in these super comfy airy lightweight soft t-shirt from yjack yes they are the sponsor of today's video so thank you so much to yjack so i'm going to spend my day wearing different yjack shirts and telling you a little bit about them but for now i am going to go work out <music> Just another sunny day in Southern California. It's where the people came to play. Don't let them transform you. Oh, come and see what you've been missing on a little stage. 
I'm home now from the gym. I have changed into another Y Jack t shirt. Same style, but different color. Y Jack is a company that creates basics for men and women. And what separates them from other brands is that they manufacture this specific type of cotton called Xfina. Xfina is a cotton that's made with extra long staple cotton yarn, which is the highest grade yarn with only 8% of the entire world's cotton yarn production. It's so smooth, silky, it's very elastic, and so lightweight and cooling. So it's perfect for the summer. You can just recognize how good the quality is by just the fabric. So I just showed you guys this basic round neck t-shirt, but they have many other styles on their website. Boat neck, boxy tee, v-necks, uh, mock tees you have a lot of different designs to choose from these have been like my favorite basics these days seriously thank you to y jack for sponsoring this video and making such comfortable breathable t-shirts for me to live in they have both a usa website and a korea website i will leave all the links in the description box below and you can use the code ashley for 15 percent off your order at checkout it's time for a meal and I felt like it's been a while since I had kimchi fried rice So I'm gonna make kimchi fried rice one of the few dishes I know how to make I'm also gonna cut these two spams So a secret behind these supposed spam looking things These are plant-based pork from Omnipork they're a vegan brand and they were kind enough to send me some of their products and I'm finally trying them out. I have my kimchi right here. They're so fermented, so sour, just the way I like them. to cook in the summertime. I'm sweating so much right now. Oh, it's hot. Time to get some Well, this is the best kimchi fried rice I've ever made. If you're a vegan, maybe try this out. It's called Omni Pork. They started selling it on Market Curly. Vegan spam in there. Market Curly do parayo. That last few drops of sesame oil really ties everything together. I feel like I just love anything sesame. Sesame oil, sesame seed, sesame snacks. back from radio and yes you guessed it I'm in another Y Jack t-shirt I'm going to do my nails so going to the nail salon is very time-consuming and it can get kind of expensive so I kept seeing ads for this brand called Ohora 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 and it's like semi cured gel so you stick it on your nail and you cure it a little more with the UV lamp and you get fresh, new, cute gel nails. I went all out, bought a bunch, no regrets, and I'm gonna do my nails right now. I filed them into the shape that I want, and I'm gonna put some cute nail designs on it. I think I'm gonna go with this one. They have different sizes, so you can choose what you want. 
They give you two prep gels and they also give you a filer. A stick you use to remove. I'm gonna use the prep pad first. Make sure there's no like oil on my nails. I remember when I first started going to the salon to get my nails done, it was like late junior high school. No, it was like high school. And all we could get was a regular manicure and we had to patiently dry them under the fan for like 10 minutes and be careful for like 6 hours after that just in case I butt my fingers onto something or I have to pee. You know, when pulling down the zipper, pulling your pants down, pulling them up, and now everything's so well made you don't have to wait for your nails to dry they dry right away under this uv lamp of course i'm sure it's not the best for the nails but once in a while it should be fine okay so i think the nail primer is dry they're thicker than i thought this is the biggest size but it's still a little too small for my thumb already stressful. I feel like my posture is getting bad. Harder than I thought. I only did three fingers so far and it took 20 minutes. Guys, I'm finally done with one hand. Hooray! <laughs> this is what my nails look like. That took about 43 minutes. Not bad. Considering that to get my nails done, I do an hour round trip commute and getting my nails done itself takes about an hour and a half. So 43 minutes, I think it's pretty good. If I have something urgent the next day, if I have like a schedule but I can't make an appointment at the nail salon, I will use this. If you especially enjoy doing your nails and doing like artsy stuff, then you guys will enjoy it. It does take practice, I feel like. You have to get used to it. My left hand definitely looks better because I did them after I did my right hand. I wasn't very good with it in the very beginning, but when I was doing the left hand, it went by super quickly. So yeah, I like the fact that you can do your nails in the comfort of your own home and not have to worry about bumping into someone at the nail salon that might have COVID or something. I don't really know how to take care of my cuticles. That's another con. When you go to the nail salon, they make your cuticles all pretty and nice and clean. So it doesn't give me the same satisfaction as you know going to the salon and looking at my hand after it's done. But anyways, it was a fun experience. But I think the most important thing is how long will it last? So I'll keep you guys updated about these self gel nails. Okay, it's literally 12 a.m. So I'm going to sleep now. It has been a long day. Happy Saturday, everyone. I'm stepping out now. I'm actually filming the Girl Talk Part 3 with Joan and Subini today. And I rented out a studio. So I gotta go out, buy wine, buy some snacks, and head on over. I'll see you guys in a bit with Joan and Subini. Okay, we'll talk about our favorite alcoholic drink. Okay. Yeah. Wait, nails. Oh my god, where are you going? Ohora. Ohora. This I, looks like what I got done. I know, right? I fell for their ad through YouTube oh and I bought it. I don't. I didn't know it works. Oh, it yeah. works. And then the Instagram ad. Until I met Ashley. I remember the YouTube ad. Chicken. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> she was like, let's order the sixty chicken. I was like, I've never seen this YouTube before in my life. Would you rather really step on the island with Matt or Pinny? Oh yeah, I want to. Oh, oh, I want to. I want to be like no, one, one, two, three. Yeah, okay. We finished filming and we came to a cafe. Wearing this still. Oh, I'm I'm wearing it still. <laughs> yeah, she's still wearing it. We ordered some coffee and some vegan gluten-free dessert. Can we do like a quick cheers? Yes. Cheers, cheers again. Can we try the avocado cake? Yes. I'm really curious. Okay. Cheers. I'm not worried about this one too. Pumpkin? No, I have faith in this one. Yeah. Very pumpkin. Oh. <laughs> oh. Always 
<laughs> I came back home, changed because it was way too hot, and now I'm on my way to a studio. More details a little later. I don't know, after the song comes out. Okay. Well, you already posted that you're, we are oh. doing it, we're in the studio together, so. So you look, could upload it. Look forward to our song. When Yay. is it coming out? It's, I don't know yet. Okay. But it will come out soon. Thanks for having me. Of course. You did so a great dark. job. Thanks, Sam. Because the music oh, wow. I was either thinking of investing in a new camera or a new computer but I thought the computer is more urgent. Once I saw the colorful ones that were released, I really wanted the blue one or the mint one or the yellow one. I just wanted to see them in person and decide so I went to the Apple store but it turns out the one in Karoskir only has three colors but me being the dummy that I am I bought a wireless keyboard while I was there because I was like okay it's gonna take a while for the iMac to come but I want the new keyboard so it's easier for me to edit on my laptop while I wait but if you order the iMac the wireless keyboard and the wireless mouse come with the iMac like there's no option to take it out, pay less money like it's just included in the price for the iMac so now I have two Bluetooth keyboards I'm gonna have to sell one of them on Tangan Market I wish I could have double checked before purchasing it's just that I went all the way to the Apple store and I was like I have to get something that was on my mind so I was like okay I've been needing the Bluetooth keyboard for a while so let me just get it I feel so dumb right now anyways you'll find out which color I went with in the next video once the iMac comes and I can't wait to have a bigger screen so I don't have to like be this close to the screen while editing but for now please look forward to the girl talk video and episode number one for season two of dive studios has been released so please go check it out and also look forward to my collab with It's gonna rain. Please look forward to my collab with Usong in his next album. Thank you so much for watching. Bye!